Hey, it's Sig here, and in this quick video, I'm going to show you how to stay productive on your computer, um, PCs, if you're a PC owner like me, Windows 7, um, and how to analyze your hard drive for uh, wasted, wasted space and to clear your C drive or whatever your operating system is sitting on um, and just clear out the erroneous files, the stuff that um, is just taking up space and is clogging up your hard drive. Um, I just recently went through um, a hard drive clean and I freed up about 11 gigs so you can see that it's like 11.6 gigs free uh, out of 60.4 uh, so uh, before that I was I was redlining it and uh, you know programs were crashing because uh, they couldn't buffer into the C drive. So quick, quick way to do it um, that I found is um, I, I run, there's all these little cleaners that clean your browser cache and whatever. It doesn't really do too much significance, um, you know, but there's one, this one app that I highly recommend and it's, uh, a lot, it just allows you to look at your C drive um, from like a a thousand foot view and and see like where is uh, the data or the files that are taking up the most space the, and and determine if it's erroneous and and just delete it so let's uh, let me show you that app here it's right here I think it's right oh yeah here we go no it's in downloads I just downloaded it it's called Space Sniffer and I just found out about this today. It's a free app and uh, it's a standalone executable which is awesome. I love that. You don't have to install it. It just You unzip it and you just run it. And it runs fast and uh, you select your C drive or your D drive or whatever drive you want and then it starts to map out um, visually in front of you in real time your hard drive and where the files are that are you know taking up the most space so um, let me just close this okay so here we go and you can see just visually um, what what is what's the most significant areas of uh, that are taking up the big space so I, l I like looking at the big guys here first and then and then start looking at the smaller guys and uh, you can see here 7.4 gigabytes is being occupied right here by a folder called app data and you can zoom into this but you just double click and then it shows you all the stuff within this app data folder all the subfolders that are taking up space and you can see Picasa is caching about 1.2 one gigabyte and OneNote is caching 1.7, Cloud Magic. Um, so I can I can go into like say this this OneNote, double click that, and you can see here my notebook is taking up 800 860 megabytes. It's quite big, um, and you can see. Oh okay, yeah you can see like all the all the little notebooks within here so that's that's the backup um, and you know what I already have it backed up on my D drive so why do I need it on my C? I don't I don't so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna right click on this okay and I'm going to delete it bam and click yes and boom I just I just freed up some space so um, if I take a look at my C, my C drive again you can see I just freed up like another gig or close to another gig so I, now I got 12.1 gigabytes free of space on my C drive so that's essentially it um, another great thing about this is uh, you can you can right click on a folder and you can click open and it will show you the explorer view of that folder okay um, and it's really easy to navigate I'm just surprised about how easy this is and how fluid it is for a free application um, and really useful and you can just kind of zoom out and you can see stuff uh, from a higher and higher level and uh, that's it uh, quick um, quick note of caution all the blue areas here is system files do not delete that um, and just be really careful here um, you know I, I can't be held accountable obviously for whatever you do to your hard drive here using this tool but um, you know just be careful because there's there's a lot of uh a lot of stuff on C that 
is required by the operating system or required by applications. Um, but if you do know that, okay, this little area here is, is used for, for caching, um, you know, especially in the user's owner's area here, um, a lot of this stuff is used by programs to cache stuff. And, uh, you know, you can, you can safely delete it as long as you have your, your uh, files backed up on, on your data hard drive. Okay? So that's it. That's